Operators of boats and other watercrafts on Pike Lake have a new tool to help protect the lake from aquatic invasive species. CD3, a watercraft cleaning station, is the first mechanism of its kind in northern Minnesota. CBS 3's Jesse Slater got to see the device in action. So, Jesse, what can you tell us? Well, CD3, meaning clean, drain, dry, and dispose, is one of only five watercraft cleaning stations in the state. While the other four reside in the Metro Twin Cities area, this one is installed at a boat launch in the Northland. It's as simple as a car wash, or in this case, a boat wash. You want to be a resource so people can clean their boats on the way in and on the way out. CD3 is an invention meant to help stop the spread of aquatic invasive species from one body of water to another. We developed CD3 Clean, Drain, Dry, Dispose as a result of talking to all the aquatic <laughs> invasive species managers in Minnesota. Only five of these unique stations exist in the state, but the Pike Lake Boat Launch has the only one outside of the Twin Cities. We received a grant, now funds the inspection program as well as funds the new cleaning station. Kenosha Township opted to participate in order to prevent the spread of zebra mussels to and from Pike Lake. Most folks know Pike Lake has zebra mussels but the, the goal of this and other types of programs is to prevent any additional. The station is equipped with several tools to ensure your boat is free of any unwanted nuisance. Air compressor, a bunch of low-tech tools to get underneath the boat to pull a plug and a vacuum to help suck all the water out of the boat or any compartments that you might have. We designed it for any type of watercraft that you might be using on a lake. CD3 creators say the spread of invasive species could cause economic and tourism troubles. If you get lakes that you can't fish in, you can't swim in, uh, it's a huge detriment financially. St. Louis County, the Kenosha Township, and CD3 hope boaters take advantage of the free cleaning station. If you enjoy boating, make sure you clean, drain, and dry your boat. According to CD3 creators, this is a completely unique concept and only exists in Minnesota. They say they have received calls from places like Washington, D.C. to the United Kingdom showing interest in the station. So, Jesse, do people have to use this? Like, are there any consequences if they don't? No, people aren't required to use the station. It's just highly suggested just to help stop that spread of invasive species in the lakes throughout the state and the country, really. Mm -hmm. Sure. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Jesse.